Okay, so for single folks, I'm talking to y'all, like me. Is it okay that we have a sex toy? Is it okay to just have like a, a bullet or you know you know some men power in the bottom drawer men i think they have something i forgot what it's called a long time ago when i used to go to passion parties you know it's like some you know a, a pocket pocket pal let me just call it that it's basically something that's shaped in the anatomy of the female and you can just you know have a good time with that rinse it out later guys let me tell you why sex toys are not okay it's not sex toys be it's not okay because our body is a temple of the living god the holy spirit is within us and if you believe that and you know that then you can't be pumping away you can't be pum -pum -pana, pum -pum -pana, by yourself okay nope no because would you be doing that in the presence of god the holy spirit the holy spirit abides within you so no, we can't be having sex. You can't do that. Not only that, I don't care what you say. When you are masturbating, your mind is coming up with all types of little pictures. You are imagining things. And when you imagine things, guys, the word of God says to cast down every imagination. You're imagining something. You might climax on whoever it is that you're thinking about. It requires you to defile your temple. It requires you to think and to picture things. A lot of times if you're watching porn with it, you're putting things before your eyes. It says if your eyes, the light of your eye is dark, your whole body is dark. If you put light before you, then your whole body is light. You understand that? So what you put before you enters into your spirit and you find yourself becoming bound you will be bound by that action guys and what's going to happen is you're going to want to do it more and more and then you can't stop yourself you fall asleep with a sticky towel next to you i'm being funny but you understand what i'm saying you're going to keep doing it and what's going to happen is it's not going to be enough to just masturbate and some of you you may be like i've been masturbating for years i ain't got no husband um maybe that's why you don't have one because it's not okay to defy your temple. And God, if you're defying your temple, you're actually opening up yourself to demonic spirit and dark spirits. And you have to think of the type of pornography you're looking at. You may start looking at this, then you start looking at that. You're opening up yourself to that. God is not going to bring that godly man or woman to you when you're full of, you know, all types of porn in your spirit. Because you're not ready for them. You're so full of porn and self-pleasure that by the time you get that man or woman, they can't do nothing for you. Especially if you go and buy one of them uh, type of dildos that, I'm sorry, we got to speak straight, that just stands up like a fire hydrant and you can turn it up. I've never used that. I don't. <laughs> but I've seen it. I've seen it. It exists. How can a man possibly do anything for you? You understand? And how can a woman truly satisfy you when you have so many images of so many women that looks perfect, perfect body or look a certain way and you've seen so many different types of sex? How can you be clean and ready for your wife? You understand? So no, guys, we can't be uh, playing the fiddle. We can't be uh, our own personal minstrels. You just have to pray. God will keep you just like he's been keeping me. All right, guys. Don't forget to like, to share, and to subscribe. I hope you understand. And uh, I'll have an email link here so you can ask me any questions. My email link is trifina39 at gmail.com. But I'll put it in the link for you. All right, guys. Bye.